Welcome back everyone and this is your full body Pilates HIIT workout with Pilates ring as an option. This is fun and challenging workout, prepare to sweat team and let's crack this. All right my friends, we will begin with a cardio warm up block, no equipment. Go ahead and dive into your knees. Take a look at the demo screen for your first exercise. Extend your arms and legs. Begin your war, guys. All the way, top out. Drive it in and all the way, guys. Straight leg and straight arm, top out. Of course, we apply all of the Pilates principles for our Pilates heat workout. As you can see, I have a circle today, which is your option. You can do this workout without any equipment. And I also have a light dumbbells. We're gonna be using the light dumbbells only for the one blow, guys. All the way reach, extend nice and straight. Pick up the pace with me so we can wake up and warm up our body very quickly for your low impact exercises today. Some of the blocks we will do it, in some of the blocks we won't just because we simply have no time to prepare for the next exercise, guys. All the way, reach through. Good job. Come on down for this one. We're gonna go for the quick tricep push up. All right, perfect. One more on the position. We're doing exactly the same exercise. We're just going to switch the sides. Extend, guys, your arms, your legs. Take a deep breath in on the position. In the three, guys. Two, one, let's begin our work together. Good connection and good outside top. Perfect. Let's try to pick up the pace a little bit, even though this is our Pilates, and we definitely want to pay attention to the good quality form, but I want you to move relatively quick today so we can get the best of this workout, this Pilates hit style, and burn as much calories as possible for this short period of time. Keep on working, guys. Good quality connection, knee to elbow, every single movement from the center, reach and top, guys. Reach and top. Breathe in, breathe out, all the way. Inhalations through the nose, exhalations through the mouth on a challenging Pilates exercises if you have to, guys. Or as long as you breathe, I'm good with this last one. All right, come on down. We go back for the tricep. Good job. Very nice. Give me just one more. In your next, in your final, guys, warm up exercise for this cardio and replacement block is your hover to walk to squat, low squat, guys. We constantly stay in a low squat in a hover. Beginners, you can put your knees on the floor. Go ahead, begin, guys. All the way. Bring the arms up, hands back. Walk to your hover. This is it. As I said, if you can't do hover yet or you have some wrist injuries or back injuries, just simply, guys, put your arms on the floor for your walk. Breathe, guys. We can go really, really quickly here, because I really want you to pay attention to your form. Come up to the full squat, and keep your arms, guys, 90 degrees above the floor. Your quad is gonna be on fire. Breathe, guys, all the way. Good work, everyone. Back up, excellent. Stay with me. Bring the arms up. Good job. We almost through. All right. Reach. One more last squat. Finish, guys. Come on back. All right. We're going to do a quick tricep here. We have a few seconds. Give me a couple more. Here your, and your next blow, guys, is your standing block. Let's get over with our standing portion of this workout and the rest is gonna be on the floor. This is challenging and demanding workout, guys. I need you to prepare to sweat and do your absolutely best. All right, let's drink the water. Take a look at the screen. 
First exercise, unilateral. We will begin with the knee lifted. If this is only one leg, lunge back. Begin, come back. Knee up and extend. We consistently holding our arms up front, guys. Nice, strong, and extended. Try to step back, glide back for the quality lunge, guys. When you do your knee extension, I want to see your knees, guys, high. Try to keep the knee 90 degrees while you extend. I know it's challenging. It's one thing to lift this knee and another thing to keep the knee lifted and extend. Brace the core, guys. Stay tall. I know your front knee, guys. Pay attention behind your toes on your lunge position. Arms working as well. This is it. We're gonna go and hold our forward pull just for a few seconds to stretch the legs and give the back some rest. All right, guys, come on back up. Exactly the same exercise. We're gonna keep the arms still up front. I know it's challenging. Try to keep your knee high on your extension. Arms on the position. Bring the knee up. Prepare, guys. Arms to the front. Begin your work. One side is always more balanced and a little bit stronger, different strengths than the other. I always find this side for me is a little bit more challenging for the balance. So I'm sure I'm slow down a little bit. Try guys to pick up your pace for the exercise and keep this speed through entire 60 seconds of work. Step back, define your lunge first. Stay about a half a second to a second before you start your way back up. Keep your arms extended, my friends, all the way. You could have used instead the circle, little Pilates ball, or you could have used a light weight or you use nothing. Come on down, guys. Put your circle up front, relax your head and neck. Take a deep breath in, deep breath out, and start to come back up. All right, guys, your next exercise. Take a look at the demo screen. Step wider, we're getting ready for plie squat. Elbows always outside. Keep the ring always slightly squeezed. Begin your plie and your chest work. Keep the chest lifted, guys. Knees going straight towards your toes and your feet fully grounded. Squeeze that circle, of course, with your arms, but I want your chest be involved as well, guys. And try not to open it all the way. Keep the circle slightly under consistent resistance. So you work your arms, your shoulders, and your chest even better. Keep resistance when you open up that circle. Just a tiny little squeeze, still there. Do not forget about your glutes. After you come out from your plie squat, squeeze them tight, guys. We work in as many muscles as we can in this workout. This is your cardio and your full body sculpting and toning. Come on back down. All right, bring your circle on the floor. Come on down for your tricep, guys. Give me just a few. And this is your longer break already. Let's make sure we stay hydrated throughout the workout. Every three exercises, we have longer break, so we definitely have plenty of time. All right, block number three. Unilateral exercise first, guys. My beginners, you will do it on your knees, my friends. Everyone else, we're gonna go in the plank, prepare, press on the circle with your hand, 
using upper body strings, your arms and shoulders, and we top power to the side, working core and obliques at the same time. This is very challenging. If you decide to be on your knees, good choice, guys. This is challenging too. You could start in your plank and then downgrade on your knees. If you get rested, you may come back to your plank, guys. Stay with me. Tap out. Press. Use upper arm strings, guys. I know it's challenging. Good job, team. Press, guys. Press. We're gonna go for a low impact for our lean back exercise. Give me one more. This was very challenging. Prepare your circle for the other side right away. Go ahead and lean back. Just for a few seconds. Try not to squat, guys. Come on back up. All right, if you did that side on your, in your plank, do the other side in your plank as well. Arm with the circle is extended. Beginners, do it on your knees. Prepare on the position, press and top out. Use the upper arm strings, guys, to press on that circle, not your wrist. Press and top out. Hold your quality plank. I need you to brace, brace your core. Stay with me, guys. I know it's challenging. Do not quit. All the way, guys. Press up. Press up. Press and top. Use the upper arm strings and shoulders. My circle is really challenging. This is medium to a maximum resistance circle. That's why you don't see it changing the shape too much. This is hard for a one arm exercise. This good. Finish strong. And last one. That felt like forever. It was hard. Put your circle guys in between. Lean back with me. Just for a few seconds. Good work, everybody. All right, come on back. We're gonna put our circle in between the bicep quickly. We prepare for the corkscrew, guys. Squeeze it slightly, put the hands closer. Begin your corkscrew. You squeeze in the circle at the same time doing your corkscrew. I know, guys. If you don't have any equipment, that's okay. You could have squeezed the ball in between or just do your core screw. Form, guys. Carry over your heels all the way through, guys. Carry over your heels all the way through. Keep squeezing your circle, guys. This is it. I know. Squeeze the circle. This workout will fly by super quickly. We're already finishing block number three. Stay with me, guys. Give me a few more seconds of work. You've got this. Breathe, squeeze the circle. All right, guys. Good work, everybody. Few seconds, three, two, one. This is was extremely challenging. Give me a quick tricep, guys. And for the next block, if you have your dumbbells ready, we're gonna be using them as well. Quickly, guys, drink your water. You need just the one dumbbell for right now. Take a look, guys, in the demo screen. Quickly, I need you to put your circle right in between your inner sides. This is your hover and arm lift with the inner thigh work, guys. If you have to be squeeze and release, squeeze and arm lift. What I was going to say, if you have to be on your knees, please do it. This is it. Squeeze it, guys. Squeeze. 
stay with me. Be on your knees if you have to with that circle, but then you will be able only to do your one leg circle squeeze. This is it. This is your lower abs, guys. This is your inner thighs. This is your arms and shoulder work quality. Scoop your belly in. Give me a good squeeze, guys. Finish strong, everybody. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. A few seconds left. We got this. We're going to hold, guys, this circle right here. Just switch your dumbbells. Take a good breath in. Good quality exhalation. Move your back. We will be ready to brace that core one more time. Try not to arch your back, guys. Prepare to work. Start strong. Finish strong with me, guys. Do not quit. You ready? I'm ready, you ready. Here we go, squeeze on the arm lift, guys. Inner thighs on fire, I know. Try maintain your hover all the way through if you can. Squeeze it. Quads, inner thighs, abs, arms and shoulders, full body, guys. Squeeze it. Squeeze it. Squeeze, guys. I know you can. Squeeze. Squeeze. All the way, lift. We almost threw it in. Lift. Second round is even harder because legs are so tired. Don't quit. Squeeze it tighter. Tight. Knees on the floor, but don't quit, guys. Come on back. Take your circle quickly. We need to make a transfer, guys, on our back. Go ahead and lay down. Take a look before you go down on the demo of your screen. This is your inner thigh work, bridge thrust, plus your chest fly, guys. Thrust through the heels, elbows slightly under 45 degrees and use your chest. Squeeze the circle really nicely. This is a light weight, so we can pick up the pace, guys. Try to lift, guys, your hips all the way up while you start already from the beginning. Squeeze that circle. I know your inner thighs screaming, guys. Use your inner thighs and your outer thighs as well as your glutes and quads to squeeze that circle. This is the most effective way. Not only you will be able to squeeze it deeper and stronger, but you also target your entire surface of flex. This is good. Push it through, guys. Squeeze it. All the way. Push it, squeeze. This is good, guys. Come on. Few seconds. All right, how we got this. Let's go ahead and hold this squeeze nice and tight. Just for a few seconds. Four, guys. Three, two, I know. I know your legs screaming. Come on up, guys. All the way, my friends. Put your circle. Put your weights down on the side. And go ahead and bring, guys, your water quickly. All right, we're moving, guys, to the next block. We're just going to be using our circle. This is your roll-up block. Your leg hover is absolutely optional. Begin your work. When you come back, keep your leg low, guys. So your lower abs are working as well. Come on up. Good job. Point your toes and begin your movement right from the center, guys. Let's pick up a good, healthy pace so we can keep up with our hip style. All it is, when we call it Pilates hit, we're working definitely on a little bit faster pace, 
We also combine higher intensity with a lower intensity, which gives those spikes so you guys reach your afterburn effect, your spikes. I mean spikes in your heart rate, guys. Luck is screaming, I know. Keep it, keep it up, keep it up. Stay with me, guys. Put your circle on the side. We're gonna go for the back straight all the way. Keep your knees, guys, straight. We ready to do exactly the same thing, guys. But this time, we're gonna be working the other side. All right, my friends, come on down. Your eyes are like above the ground. Put it on the floor if you have to. And prepare, let's crush this. Keep pointing your toes, guys. Your quads are active. You coming up exactly from the center of your body. This is it. Lift. Come on up, lift. Hover it lower if you can with me. This is good. All right, guys, very good form, everybody. I feel like you're doing your absolutely best, so please keep up with my expectations. All right, guys, keep on breathing. Quadricep is getting really, really on fire. Do not stop, guys. Cover the luck if you can. It seems like a simple exercise at the first view, but once you start to feel this luck, it's actually taking away tension from the strong core work. Last one. Come on back. Put your circle, guys. Come on down. Forward for your forward pull. Stay with me, lengthening your spine. We're gonna go for our roll up teaser. We begin our roll up with our knees bent and then we do circle transfer. As you see on your preview. My beginners, you can keep your knees bent. You don't have to extend them. Let's go. Transfer the circle all the way around. I know it's taking you out of your balance from your teaser. We can do it. Legs extended or you keep your legs bent if you are a beginner. Keep on working, guys. I know, hard. Stay with me. All right, guys. All the way, straight arms. Carry over that circle. We're adding up abs and obliques work. And of course, this is your core challenge. It's very challenging to stay with legs extended and keep carry over the circle quickly. Come on up. All right, abs getting tired. Powerhouse getting tired. We're not going to quit, guys. Up. This is good. Come on up, guys. Come on down. Put your circle. Let's stretch our backs, especially our lower back. Very nice. All right. Nice and quick, guys. Let's go ahead and drink our water. Believe or not, this is already your block number six coming. And then we will have left only one final block, seven blocks total today. Unilateral exercise. It's your upward plane, guys, with your ankle on your circle. We're not doing any tricep, anything. I just want to see them a good quality hip lift. Keep pressing on the circle. Keep, guys, your hips Lift it, make sure that your wrist feeling good and your wrist is somewhere being very close underneath your shoulders. Give me a good leg work. This is your glute, quad, and entire leg working. Keep your hips lifted, guys. Don't stop pressing on that circle. This is it. This is challenging, guys. Keep this plank, upward plank. We get in there. Almost, guys, we're more than halfway through on this side. For our low impact, we're gonna keep the leg on the circle and do a good quality stretch. Keep the hips lifted. Keep pressing, guys, 
even though it is your ankle, you use an entire leg, my friends. Good, last one. This was challenging, not just for core and leg, but also for the arms. Keep your leg on the circle and fold forward. We will give it a few seconds. Feels good. All right, let's make sure we have time to switch and prepare for the other side. Your arms tired, that's gonna be even more challenging for this side. We're not going to quit. Set your wrist underneath the shoulders, hips up nice and high, making your work. Use entire leg. Watch your hips, guys. Do not drop your hips. Keep pressing, but keep your core and your hips stable. Keep pushing. All right, all right. Hips up, guys. Keep pressing, use entire leg. Movement starts in a hip flexor and all the way down. Entire leg is working. This is core, leg strings, and definitely arms and shoulder strings. Keep the hips, keep working, guys. Push it, don't stop. We almost done, guys. Can you believe your block number six is already almost over? We finish in exercise number two. Keep pushing, guys, don't quit. Hips up, magnificent. All right, keep the lock on a circle. Move it a little bit if you have to. Go ahead and fold forward. Good quality stretch. Keep that knee, guys, extended. Few seconds. Let's make sure we're ready for next exercise. Next exercise, guys, is all about lower abs. We're gonna go in the forearms. Bend your knees, my friends, if you have to. On the position, begin your work. Make sure that you can brace your core with quality and not to arch your back. This is challenging, point your toes and keep, guys, stretching your circle. Not only so you don't lose that circle, but you also work in your legs, guys. Circle is an amazing tool, makes it so much different. Harder, I would say as well, bringing the variety in building our strengths and endurance different way than regular Pilates or even the dumbbells. Scoop the stomach in, guys. Try not to touch the floor. Shoulders away from the ears, keep stretching that circle. Freeze, guys. Do not stop, please. Stay with me. Few seconds left. Come on down. That was very challenging. We will go ahead and dive into our tricep one more time. Give me just a few repetitions. And we are on our way. Stay hydrated. All right. We have our final blow, guys, left. Let's drink our water. We're gonna go on our back. This is a challenging core and abs blow, guys. Come on down. This is your Roger, guys. Roll up. Then we're gonna crunch lifting our feet in the Roger. Come on up. Top with your toes, your circle. Try to make sure that you bring your legs as high as you can, holding your circle stable. We're not really releasing the circle much. Come on up. Not only come up and sit up with the bind feet in the program is much more challenging than with feet on the floor, but also your lower abs are working really good here. Make sure you don't release the circle. You leave the guys your feet mostly. Keep the arms straight. We've got this. Focus on the form, guys. On a good quality form. I got you. Come on up. All the way. Breathe. Put your circle quickly, guys, on the floor. We're going to stretch inner thighs. Give me just a few seconds. Hope that 
Pound dangle or our frogger, seated frogger hold. We coming back down, guys. Your legs extended or feet on the floor if you have to. This is your, guys, chest work and lower leg hold to frogger, my friends. Lower back on the ground. You squeeze the circle while you lift your legs. Then you draw the frogger in. You extend and you let your chest go. Lift, squeeze. Frogger draw. Push it back. Hold your only release, guys. Your chest work and your arm work after you bring the legs on the floor. Lift, squeeze. Draw the frogger. Come back. Release right now. Squeeze, guys. Lower back on the floor. Come on back. Release. Squeeze, lift. Draw this frogger. Extend shoulders on the floor. Squeeze, use the chest. Extend. Now let go of the chest and arm work. Squeeze. Draw it in. Push it. Release. Finish strong, guys. Squeeze. Draw it in. Push. This is good. Come on up slowly. Put your circle, guys. Stretch your back. All right, we have final exercise of this block number seven. Challenging your circle, guys, optional. We're gonna go for that jackknife, circle in between the ankles, then lower leg hold or your knees bent. Prepare, guys. Begin your work. Lower the legs or you can bend your knees, guys. Come on down. We only lower in the legs until we feel that our back is staying grounded. If you feel that your back, guys, starting to arch on the floor, then bring your legs higher. This is it. Lower your legs. Give your guys absolutely best. This is your final exercise of this block and of this workout. Come up. Good, reach guys. And lower. We've got this. Reach. Lower. Reach guys, few seconds. Lower. This is it. Come on up slowly with me. We're gonna dive to the final quick set of the tricep push up. Let's do guys 10 together. Make sure that you are starting in the plank. Elbows are right along your rib cage. Scoop the stomach in, begin guys. One, two, three. I want to make sure that you leave your workout slightly tired. Yes, happy of course, but definitely your full body will be worked out for the day. Give me four more, three more, just in case. Two more, one more, guys. Shift your hips all the way back. Extend those arms. I'm so proud of you. I'm sure, guys, you did your absolutely best. You gave yourself your maximum effort. Come on up. Set your feet, guys, wider. And put your hands nice and flat on the floor. Release your head and neck. Make sure there is no tension. My beginners, if you ma want, you must go on your knees right now for your crisscross hold. Please do that. You can do this. Straight on your kneeling position. And hold away, opposite direction, guys. Good quality, ankle. This is it. And slowly, guys. Walk back on your knees with me. We will take our arms to the front. Very nice. Your chest may or may not reach the ground, and this is okay. We will give it just a few seconds. This is a good upper body stretch. Mm -hmm. 
and come on back. Let's come up all the way to our knees and we do a couple lateral stretches and our quick back stretch. Reach to the side, arm all the way above your head and all the way guys to the other side. Reach, reach, reach. Four guys, three, two, and up all the way, reach those arms up. Inhalation, exhalation all the way back, guys. Expand through the chest, reach up, and let's switch. In through the nose, out through the nose, through the mouth. Make sure that you expand through your ribcage. And take your hands, guys, on the floor. Come on up, step wider for your final plea squat. Reach, and all the way back down. Inhalation, reach up. Exhalation, magnificent guys, fantastic, outstanding job. I want you to be proud of yourself because you are working hard every single day. We're getting stronger together. Welcome for the channel. If that was your first workout today, make sure you guys to subscribe. Leave me a comment down below. Rest well, recover well. I will see you all tomorrow.